Okay, so uh, welcome to the next video in my series of uh, AV Converter tutorials. Uh, this time I'm going to teach you how to put a watermark on top of a video so you can have a, uh, a logo or something uh, in your video. So uh, here's the video that we're going to add the watermark to. Okay, so that's the video, and here is my uh, watermark that I've created. Uh, I created this uh, watermark in a, in a GIMP, and um, what I've done, the way I'm going to do it is uh, I've made a transparent background, and I've made the picture exactly the same size as my video. So um, when I put the watermark on top of the video, I'll just have to put it right on top. If you have a... Um, if you have just a watermark, I'll tell you later on how you can do it with just the uh, watermark, but you're going to have to have a transparent background. Okay, so uh, if we go into terminal again and uh, start up with uh, the avcon command, our input is, sorry, our input is uh, input.mov, and uh, we're going to use the overlay filter. So uh, we start with VF for video filter, and we uh, put in our the movie. The it's called the movie, but it's actually our watermark. The thing we're going to put on top of our main video, and that is the watermark PNG image. And then uh, we'll put a a reference there. And then over here we'll. Uh, call in the watermark and set the overlay parameters so the par parameters are where you want your more watermark to be so for me it's going to be zero uh, sorry it's going to be a uh, zero zero because I'm gonna have it over the whole uh, video so it's starting in the top left hand corner but uh, if you just have a small one then if you want it in the bottom you can have um, uh, you can use like uh, the width and height of your uh, of your main video using these parameters uh, main underscore width main underscore height and then the parameters of your overlay uh, watermark with uh, overlay underscore width and overlay overlay underscore height sorry so if you wanted you could have uh, something like uh, a x value of 10 and a y value of the height of the main video minus 10 that would put it in in the bottom left hand corner uh, so I'm gonna have it at 0 0 and then uh, put an out there to end the uh, video filter and I'll use the uh, codec that we've been using, the Libx264, sorry, codec. And uh, we'll have an output in an MKV format. Uh, sorry, I uh, forgot to change directory. So uh, the encode has started, and uh, I'll see you when it's finished. Okay, so that's done. It was uh, finished pretty fast, and I'll show you the finished product. So we're gonna have a uh, watermark right about here. As you can see, uh, the watermark's in the correct place. And if you've done it um, the other way around without making the picture the size of the video, then as long as you'd uh, fiddled around with the uh, x and y coordinates, you would have got it in roughly the same place. Thank you.